This is head football coach Wayne Dabbs on game day, the opening game of the 2021 season at Whitfield, kickoff at 7.30. All right, coach, it's been a long summer of training and we finally get a chance to play tonight. Tell us how excited you and uh, the guys are to get out there. Uh, well, it's good to see you again. It has been a long time, it feels like, uh, being able to do this. I always thank you uh, for doing this and hosting this each week. Um, really appreciate you in the athletic department. Um, it's been a good off season. Um, the summer's been more of a normal summer for us as far as the workouts um, on the field in the weight room. We've got a great group of young men. Um, they've worked really hard. Uh, they're very focused. We've got a big group of seniors this year that kind of know what the responsibility is and what the expectations are. Um, so we're excited about the opportunity to get to go and just play on a Friday night against a really good football team like Whitfield. A lot of last year's team had a lot of playmakers on the squad, and this year we have to replace them. So, uh, how do we do that? Um, we'll just get on the field, you know, and get some experience with some of these guys. But we did lose some really good athletes, some good players, some good leaders um, in the classroom, on the field, in our community. So, you know, we've got some holes that we need to fill. But the only way to fill those holes is to get out on a Friday night and go compete against good teams and, and kind of find out where we're at. I think a lot of teams are kind of in that boat this year. Is you know, what do you have and you don't really know until you get out and start getting some competition. So we're excited about it tonight. You had a scrimmage last week at Prince. Tell us what you liked that you saw. We were physical. Uh, we didn't show a whole lot, but our, our kind of our game plan for scrimmages has nothing to do with a school board or scheming up against, you know, that opponent. It's really just getting our guys on the field, see who's going to go tackle, who's going to go block somebody, who's going to, you know, get the guys lined up right, um, and who's going to go compete. Um, and we were able to accomplish that. I felt like against Prince, um, they showed us some weaknesses that we had, and I felt like we kind of shorted some of those things up. Um, but now it's just time to go, go get after Whitfield and um, you know, get our community around us and get, get excited about Friday nights again. Speaking of Whitfield, we played them last year here at our place. Close game, back and forth. What do you see from them this year that you've seen on film? Uh, Coach Joyner, he's a good friend. Um, ever since he's, he's arrived at Whitfield, he has really done a great job of turning that program into what it is today. They are very athletic, very big, several D1 guys on that team. Uh, good scheme, well coached. Uh, they're confident they did beat us here last year, so they'll be excited about the opportunity to host us at their place. So it'll be a tough challenge for us, but like I said, the only way for us to get better is to start them. So let's get after them on Friday night. Game one of 2021. Coach, good luck.